friends welcome to crafty healing hope everyone's doing great and in today's video i'm going to be showing you again another circle or sunburst dutch pour i'm just so in love with these and i can't stop doing them and my colors that i'm using yep you might see a pattern here i seem to love teal and magenta so i have using art minds timeless teal in which I added a bit of, I had some uh, dark blue drips and I added that to it to make it a little bit darker teal color. And then um, I have just the regular timeless teal. So there you can see the um, difference in the shades. Also I'm using Liquid Texas um, Magenta, Quinacridone Magenta. And also I am using Art Minds. Um, it's not Art Minds, sorry. It's uh, Deco Arts Metallics in um, Berry, I believe. And the purple that I have as a base is from um, drips from uh, previous paintings. Um, I am also using Amsterdam's uh, Titanium White in the middle there. And uh, I really loved doing this um, this uh, pour. It was so fun. I had to finagle with it a bit. Um, first, I'll use my blow dryer, and then I'll use the wonderful, wonderful mini dryer, um, blow dryer, the mini blower. It it's just so good to fix up thing, you know, areas that you don't like. So uh, I'm just gonna let you guys watch this video. I hope you guys like it. Um, please let me know your suggestions or your observations or how you feel in the comments below. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. And if you like the video, please press like. And uh, it really encourages me and it, it makes me just want to do more and post more. It helps my channel and, and I really appreciate all the support and, and you know, feedback that I get. Um, so... I will catch up with you guys on the other end when we can check out the um, results, both wet and dry, I believe, hopefully. Until then, hope you enjoy.
So as you can see, I'm adding um, touch-ups with the teal. I wish there was more teal in that upper right side. Uh, I'm not as satisfied with this upper right side as I am with the left side. However, I still like it. I mean, I'm learning with each and every new painting that I'm doing. It, there's never a, you know, a down. It is always just positive because I'm learning from each one. And uh, what is really interesting, as you will see here in a minute, or, is that after it dried, it looked even better. I'm quite mm, uh, happy about that. Uh, it just it just got enhanced. Um, I did uh, torch it and a lot of more cells popped up in the middle there and the whole character of it and the whole you know look of it just totally got enhanced. I did put on a just spray one coat of the Rustoleum um, gloss uh, on this in the dry result as you will see here in a minute. And uh, I am loving the dry results so much. And uh, anyhow, I learned a lot from this and I hope you guys enjoyed it. And please let me know, as I said, I love to read your comments. And, uh, you know, hope you guys are doing well and uh, keeping safe. Keep blessed, my friends. And until next time, take care.